Okay, race 30 over at Southern Air for a couple of championship legs. First up is the William Hill Mile. This is leg two. It's a 0-90 handicap and it's a fairly big field. So number one is Camp for Van for Darren Thompson. Two in Grand Senor for Hilltop. Can't first strike for Del Hinton is three. Red Dane Hill for David Robson along with Harder Than Hard. Cassius Clay for Molly Surfer. Hyphy Hasito for Vinnie Jarrod. Light Stage for Hand Jones. Apollo for Django. Rattle and Hump for Pontypool. Vincent Price of Martin Leedham, Shooting Quates of Hans Joan, I next for Dan Hughes, Kindred Spirits of Martin Leedham, Born on Venus for Axe Cherry, Bavid Deckham for Stu Gray, Fredo for James Follis, Philippa is fast for Downhouse, Challon for Kevin Meenan, Solano Fire for Alex Cherry, Thunderbird for Kevin Meenan, Fifth Side for Dan Hughes, Human Race for Stu Gray, Man Another for Darren House. And it's one of those races, if you're lucky, you might win it. 24 of them, they're in the gates. If you're wide, which I think is poor old. John Morgan, widest of all, out in the car park. Unless you can get over and across before you get to the bend. I'm not going to have a chance in it. But the one that has done well from a wide draw is Camphor Vans. He came out of the 20 stall. He's got himself right wide over it towards the fence. He's been followed through by Human Race. And then Thunderbird. Pushing through now is a Red Dane Hill. Don't get a mention here. I apologise. Most of you are all pretty much close together. But I think you're going to need to be closer to the rails. The poor old fifth side out really wide. So take this top left bend. Inside four and a half now. It's only uh, half a mile left to travel. It's camp for van from Red Dane Hill. It's a Lano fire. As you can see, anything that's wide's already lost probably five to six lengths and still losing it now. Programs rattle and hum. It's not going to be rattling and humming from there. So we're still being led by Camp for them. You know, the best jockey of the day. He's got his horse over towards the fence, but he is top weight. And he's now going to be challenged by Shooting Quasar that's come out of the pack here. I'm sure of those silks. But it's Camp for Vamp still as we get down to the furlong and a half. And it's Camp for Vamp by a couple to Shooting Quasar and Apollo. It's really between these. And in fact, Camp for Vamp's been there since the beginning. We're inside the final furlong now. And they're not going to catch this top weight. Camp for Vamp's going to take this very, very comfortably. The pillar to post. A super, super easy win there for Gareth Thompson. Takes it from Apollo and Shooting Quasar. I think John's... El Grand Senor got up for fourth. So Camp for Van for Darren Thompson takes that. Second was Apollo for Django. Third was Shooting Quasar for Hans Jones. Fourth was Red Dane Hill for David Robertson. And fifth was Cassius Clay for Molly at Surfer. You can see down the rest of the pack. Plenty didn't get mentioned. At Bavid Deckham, Challons, Human Race, Kindred Spirits. Fredo, Born on Venus, obviously had a good draw but didn't, couldn't do much. Uh, Zolano for Fire coming out of seven. The rest all pretty wide as you can see. I'm sure we'll go back up the top. Let's have a look. Harder than hard. And down Thompson Hurst's horse deserves a big round of applause. Coming out of 20 and still winning that off top weight. As you can see, El Grand Senor did well to come out of Haifi Hasito out of 14 did well as well. But Apollo shooting Quasar and Cassius Clay that made three of the five all come out the first five gates.